it gives me a little foo-foo. Shows that booty ass. Yeah, you like my booty. Leave my booty alone. You scare me. I'm going to take you home. You know, if you and Lizzie could bottle up your butt and sell it to Dwayne Reed, I would buy it. I'm telling you. Well, here, let me give it... No. Speaking of booty, did you know that Madonna is back in Africa trying to adopt another child, a four-year-old girl named Mercy James? And some people are just really not happy about it. An African-American human rights group called her a bully, and the child's grandparents uh, or grandmother is accusing Madonna of trying to steal the child. Mm -hmm. Now, I, this is a, you, but I, I, I just have some questions. Yeah. Is, the, is the grandmother able to take care of the little baby? Probably not. No. She's, she in, be she's in an orphanage. She's in an orphanage. I guess she spends time supposedly there, but it isn't an orphanage. She's um, poor. The little grandmother. Mercy. She has yeah. uncles also. There are other people. And so nobody's able no to take care, take of, the care of the kid. No one can take care of the kid. So Madonna has decided to go and adopt this but child. But laws that I thought didn't she um, have to bypass some laws about adopting from out of out of country adoption? Well, when that's she adopted one of the David, criticism right? is that she's jumping to the front of the line mm -hmm. yeah. on this, and maybe that's a problem I mean, that people I have. Mean, but I understand. Say, why not just send money to the orphanage or the family? Why do you have to take the kid out of her family's out of her country? Well, I think what, what she did I with David, she why, has I living relatives. I can understand relatives. why she wants to adopt it. She's got David. She's David. You know, a lot of times people, Angelina Jolie did it. She has two kids from the same region. Yes. So she might want David to have a brother or Agreed. a sister who is from the same region as him, who is a, a sibling. Mm -hmm. who he, Because otherwise, otherwise, David has nobody that looks like him well, in that family. Gonna, well, then, then they will have that bond of just growing up knowing that you have that same rooting as so someone else. I understand else. why she wants to go back over. Sure, I understand right. that. I think the problem that would be maybe not with just this child. I think the problem that people are bringing up is why, why even do that. Why not come here to this country? We have children who need homes here. And that's been the argument for a long time. Look, but kids across you go, the world need homes. Yeah. And I think if you're giving a child a loving home, it's an incredible thing to do. And I think to, I don't know, it's hard to pass but judgment when someone's taking a child in and loving home. Is it less restriction sometimes when you go? Because I know a lot of people go over. Probably. It's it's a little bit easier to yeah, adopt. I think, I think that there are not as, uh, as much criteria when you're adopting from across the world yeah. as there are here. Don't have to worry about the you mother know. trying but to come back in. What if wanted to adopt it, a, an African-American child here? I think it might be a little hard would for her here. Would she have trouble doing that? Yeah. Well, she'd, I, have, she'd have a harder time jumping the line because it would be more yeah. publicized and, and also, more people complaining about that child. Jump, though, yeah, sure. well, there, there, for adopting, uh, black Whenever ladies. you want to adopt a child, there's a line to jump. There's a lot of a lot of red tape. And one of the craziest things is that, you know, it's, it's good that it is as difficult because people want to make sure they're not just handing this child over over to some right. looney tune, right. you know, which you don't have to worry about. You know, you can go to other countries and, and get a child relatively quickly, or you used to be able to, and bring them home. And, you know, they didn't, they just want it off their books, But basically. a lot of people are thinking she's in looney tunes, because if you read her sex book, it's a little bit out there, kissing the girl on television, all the stuff that she does, As you know, what has done. You have a kiss the girl. But then I'm not saying, saying I agree with that, but I'm saying a right. lot of people Well, they're not that. separating the artist from the parent. You know, that's a discussion that right, we continue yeah. to go back to. Where right, do you yeah. separate the person well, from performance? I, I mean, I... As a, as a used-to-be performance artist, I mm -hmm. did many things that I probably would not want to be held Again, into account yeah. right mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. You like know, what? now it's... Tell us. None of your business, <laughs> <laughs> She can already tell. We already know. Yeah, I've never told... Okay. You can look it up, okay. though. Okay. It's okay. everywhere. Okay. Thank God there's no YouTube from my day. <laughs> do you know... Oh, trouble. my God. Are you kidding? <laughs> <laughs> but you know, it's it's so <laughs> kind of tapes and stuff. <laughs> it's hard. I was, hot. <laughs> I was hot. Don't don't get me wrong. I was cute. You know, with this yeah. adoption thing, it's so hard to speak out in judgment against Madonna because sure. you know, who who are those of us that are trying to go on and adopt a baby right. and make yeah. a difference and uh, take well, one of these kids? I, out well, of you know, I just find it extraordinary because none of none of us, you know, walk a mile in anybody's shoes yeah, but our that's own. True. So right. you know, I, I've read some of the. You know, some of the very dismissive things that have been written in some of the news, local newspapers. And I'm always surprised that people get so vitriolic about it, mm -hmm. get so nasty, right. call her personal names and all kind of stuff. And all this chick's trying to do is, you know, live her life as mm -hmm. she thinks is right. So, well, hats maybe off. Give someone a life well, somebody that she in the feels. post said that she's yeah. having a midlife crisis. Andrea Pizer says she's having a midlife Who isn't? crisis. Yeah, really. Yeah. I'm sure crazy. Andrea's having a midlife Everyone's crisis too. Crisis right and I now. want David to have a. You know, I would love for David to have a sister that is from the same region, somebody that he can relate to.
Sure. I think, I, I think we'll it's important. It I think a lot of families do I go down that road. Uh, you know, let her do, let her do what she likes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, let her do what she yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah, what she 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 go not so fast. She, she still going. has living relatives, this child, who are objecting to it. So we're yeah. not. it's not well, so, so fast. So did David. His yeah. father was Remember? upset that David hadn't come back until two years later. She yeah. adopted him in 2006. It's you know, there was. But he signed a paper, and apparently he was illiterate and didn't know what he was signing. So they Right, that's what I mean. There was a living relative there. I'm saying things, hurdles are jumped. Speaking of jumping jumps, hurdles. Yeah, jumps. well, if she wants, she gets what she, she wants jumps. to get. So, speaking of getting what you want, what happened on Dancing with the Stars last night? Oh, oh my goodness. I was watching. That was fun. Well, that, what is it, Giles? What's that guy's name? Giles. Giles. He was, I couldn't, they said he couldn't separate the dancer from the from the contestant. I mean, he really, they were good now, last Giles night at that dance. Giles is known for the shower scene in Sex in the City yeah. movie. That's what Giles is known for. Shower. So they yes. told Giles to get, you know, channel his inner actor, and he, and he did. channeled that shower he scene. He channeled it right there on that dry floor. He was, I mean, it on was an outstanding dance. Giles. 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 It's some gyrating Why is he on Dancing with the Stars? Because I don't know. He's, because he he's was in a shower scene yeah. on yes. yes. Sex in the City yes. movie. That's why I said they need to come to New York but and, it, and it, get some. Maybe they'll do it yes. for you, yeah. Sherry. But yeah. they went from super sexy, and then Sean Johnson, who I waited for and love, Olympic champion. She flipped around during the Lindy, and I thought she was so great. Before her performance, she said, this week I can finally feel like myself. I don't have to be sexy and romantic. I can just be a teenager and be myself. And I thought she Are had so much the fun. The Lindy. The, Lindy. the Lindy. the Lindy. That's not the Lindy that well, I know. It was the Olympic Lindy. <laughs> Flip onto this, onto this stage like that. Sport. I think that's the jitterbug. In yeah. the 40s, they did something a little, little more act, um, okay. physical she, than the Lindy. Yeah. 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 Look, you're not going to see a Lindy yeah. like this anywhere no. else. But no. she, their scores were okay. I think she had two eights and a nine, which were not good compared to the three tens that Giles had. That and Giles then Dancing with the Star. Oh no, dumb. Bachelor Melissa and has like. Got Two tens and a nine. Yes, maybe. she did. And then I, little, 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 uh, that's Melissa right there, and she's doing her Lindy. She's doing a good job. And she, on her. but you know the person I love because she's really trying hard is Lil Kim. Lil Kim got a twenty six. She did the Argentine oh, tango, oh. and uh, she was really good. She got the yeah. twenty seven out of thirty. She seems so, so they, sophisticated. That dance, I guess, would call well, for that. Well, you know, that, for the hip hop and the rap, and so she's very graceful. Yeah, I thought she did a, a good now job that's too. A booty. It was fine. Yeah, yeah, Lil Kim. Okay, that's a booty. I'm, I'm just saying, you want to talk about a booty? That was a booty. <laughs> yeah. And not a bad booty at no, all. She's got a good booty. Yeah. <laughs> now listen, speaking of booty, yeah. someone I know is doing a pilot for television. I think it's going to be shot here in New York, and she may even need a studio audience. Do you know anything about that, you guys? Yeah, so thank you. No, I'm do, I, I uh, you know, Lifetime uh, right. pick greenlit my pilot. It's a sitcom right. pilot about, uh, it's my stand-up uh, of taking lemons and turning it into lemonade about right. the fact of, uh, you know, right. uh, infidelity in a child and right. moving a post-divorce and moving on. So, See, but I, I think that divorce would pay off. <laughs> when I couldn't get out of bed. I was crying so much about how am I going to smile? My, you know, my best friend is gone and, and the fact that I got on stage and it was cathartic and now, it, you know, I, it's going to be a sitcom. Your perspective, I think, is so needed. I mean, if you know Sherry personally, you know that she just does literally take those lemons into lemonade, but in a funny way. I think it it's, so, it's almost funny. prescriptive. Like, it is, it is what I think it's women need. It's a very need. funny pilot. I'm really hoping good. Lifetime will pick need? it up. But what I need is a, is a studio audience. We're actually, no, we're actually taping it in, in L.A. Oh, so if now. you're in L.A. and you want to be part no, I'm sorry. But if they pick it up, we will be doing it in New York, uh, oh, along sorry. with The View. So, but if you're in L.A. and you want to come to the taping of my pilot, go to our website, The View's website, and you can log on and get tickets to come see me do yes. my sitcom. Yes. And you For know what? Time. Before we go, just before April we go. 9th. April 9th. Okay. You know, before we go, uh, you know, Barbara and all of us yeah. wanted to send a message to Lisa Ling saying that we got you in our hearts and we're thinking about you. Uh, her sister, producer Una Lee, uh, will supposedly be standing trial in North Korea. Sorry? No, that's, oh, that's her producer. Look, uh, give it to me one more time. Okay, not you. Okay, Lisa Ling's sister, Laura, yeah. and producer Yuna yeah. Lee will reportedly stand trial in North Korea, yeah. accused of illegal entry and hostile acts against the state. So Barbara just wanted uh, to let everybody know yeah. that she, even though she's not here, we all send our, yes. our yes. love to her. We're very concerned. Yeah, yes. very concerned. Lisa and her sister, because yeah. she's part and of Yuna. our family. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And... Um,
we hope for the best. Yeah. Right. So we're going, we're coming back with more hot topics.